Hello everybody, this is LegoMax10 and today I'm here and I'm going to be showing you guys how to create colorful world names in Minecraft. So as you can see, I have some worlds that are just plain white, like these worlds, but some of them have colorful, some of them have bolded words, as you can see parkour is bolded there, and there's color in the names of the, the worlds. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do that. So I'm going to start things off by just creating a new world and naming it like, uh, color world. That's not how you spell world, is it? And then, just, uh, it doesn't matter, so uh, create a new world. Oh shoot, her head shader's on. It's fine, not a problem. This is actually really looking cool. <laughs> uh, all right, so uh, we don't need to do anything in the world, I was just creating it. So now, you're gonna to need to install a certain program called NBT Explorer, and you can find it on the Minecraft forums. Oops, wrong page. You can find it on the Minecraft forums, it's right here. So, I will put a link to this in the description to download it, but uh, you can go ahead and download it. There will also be a link to the download. Uh, you can just click right here to go to the download link, which I already have open. Click uh, download the zip file right there, and then it will be installed. So once you have the zip file downloaded, you're going to need to extract it to uh, an unzipped folder. And you can do this by using a program like 7-zip to unzip. Uh, files and there also might be something built into Microsoft, like whatever it is, Windows 10, I'm not sure. So uh, one way I, I do it is just by double clicking the app, the application right there. This is the this is the program, and double click it and it'll just say extract all. So I already have mine extracted here in this folder, and as you can see now, this has a, a logo because it's not in a zipped folder. And then all you would need to do is really just double click this and it'll open it up. Here's my world, so if I want to change the color of the color world, I'm going to click this plus next to the world folder. I have five worlds and these are the names of them. So I'm going to click the plus there, and then go down to level.dat, where you see that. And then click on data. And here's a bunch of different um, data files that you wouldn't normally be able to see in the, in the game or edit in the game, but you can actually see it here. And one of them is, I believe, level name. And then you want to click that, click it again, double click it I mean. And then now you're going to need to use a special character and some formatting, which is what I had this tab open for. This is the Minecraft uh, Wikipedia, um, Minecraft Wiki, not Wikipedia, different things. Uh, which shows different color formatting and as well as um, general, uh, like bold, this is this will make it basically go crazy. Don't do that. I mean, you can if you want. So I'm gonna make um, the color part of world green. Um, so for that, I'm gonna need to do this symbol and then two. And you can actually type this symbol by going here and then pressing Alt, two, and one at the same time, and it will type it. So now then I'm gonna put two, and now this will make the color world all green, but I don't want the world part to be green, I want the world part to be blue and I also want it to be bolded. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, type, I'm going to do alt 1 2, or alt 2 1, sorry, again, and I want it to be blue, so I'm going to do 3, because that's the blue I want, and I also want it to be bolded, and as you can see here, the formatting for bold is a, is a lowercase l. So I'm going to do alt 2 1 again, type it, and then press l. And now, it will be um, green on the color, this turquoisey blue color, uh, and then bold is as well in the world. And uh, if you do want it to be just normal colored, you can do, well, as you can see, this uh, symbol and then R will basically reset it. So if I were to uh, do Alt to 1 and then R and then uh, reset just to show you that this works. Um, so now this won't have any of the bold or the color affected on it. It basically resets it back to white and not bolded or anything. Um, and then I'll just add uh, something else just so that you can see. This symbol and then K makes the crazy spaz text. So I'm going to type hello. That is that is not... I'm, I'm messing up my typing today. So this is now my world name. So I'm going to click OK and it should update it. And then all I need to do now is just click this save button. Save all modified tags right there. Now it's saved. So now I can go back into game, click single player, and as you can see, 
there it is, my world. And wow, that shader's really made the... <laughs> that, makes it look, that makes it look really good. I don't know why I don't have a skin, but whatever. So as you can see, this worked. It's now green, and now it has bolded and this blue color, and then I reset it and then spazzed out the text right there. So that's how you change the color of a, a world name. If you guys found this tutorial helpful, please uh, like the video and also subscribe if you'd like to see more. Okay, I'm an Alex. It doesn't matter though. I don't care. Um, so yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please subscribe. I have shaders now, so that's, that makes me happy. It looks really cool. Um, so yeah, make sure you guys like and subscribe, share and favorite it, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.